we're in Victoria. Just whether he's looking for further straight away, he, he's placed up to 1,700. He ran a uh, good second first up behind our rocket. He was beaten a length, but probably should have finished a bit closer to the winner. That was at 1,300. He jumps to 1,500 second up today. Star Appearance has had two runs back from a break for a fifth behind Pick Me Up and a second at Hawkesbury over the 1,400 behind Star Postman last start. $2 to 230 on track. Santelmo, 250 to 380 And Espresso Shot comes off a, a second here over a mile behind More Than Fabulous and a fairly strong maiden. It's $5 into 460 as Dave joins us from Sky One. So, smallish field but competitive maiden all the same. Now, Santelmo will come up and complete the line for Adrian Late. Second race of the day. Yellow Glen Handicap, 1,500. Track down to a soft five after the first. Stand by. We're right now and away. Yours truthfully out wide was the first one into stride. Espresso shots going through to take the lead off it, though. Star appearance will tuck in third and then followed by Lengasuka fourth the rail. Santelmo fifth and then interlocked and my golden eye will drop down to last. 1,200 left to run, Espresso shot the leader, three parts of a length in front, of yours truthfully racing in second, Lengasuka is hugging the fence third, star appearance fourth, a length away next, Santelmo, and then interlocked, and my golden eye, one and three quarters away last of all. So they're about to head off the back now, inside the 900 peg. And at a pretty much of a crawl, Espresso Shot is the leader by one length to yours truthfully. One and three quarters away, Lengasuka the inside of Star Appearance and San Telmo's next in the running line. And it can track Star Appearance everywhere it goes, the second elect. Interlock next the inside, the length of my golden eye last. 600 left to run as they just start to quicken up the speed and what shapes as a dash home here. Espresso Shot's trying to sneak away from them, leading by two lengths now to yours truthfully. Star Appearance in third, another two away. San Telmo's off the bit, then my golden eye, followed them by Lengasuka and Interlocked. Espresso Shot narrowly in front, but yours truthfully coming, so too Star Appearance. San Telmo won't go straight, and then my golden eye down the outside. Star Appearance hit the front with 100 to go from yours truthfully my golden eye and San Telmo it's star appearance in front my golden eye and neck away won't get there star appearance beat my golden eye and San Telmo yours truthfully fourth and then followed espresso shot interlocked and Lengasuka at the tail end star appearance the winner here number five Lester Grace riding for Gerald Ryan the gelding three years of age by star witness breaking through its start number five 210170. We'll get him by about a half a length of my golden eye. Ian McRoberts uh, bringing two down from Tauri for the first win, a ruling queen at 16 odd dollars. And my golden eye runs a, a place at big odds in the second. And San Telmo was in third spot. So standing by for the result. It's coming up in the frame now. 5 6 1. 5 first, star appearance. Lester Grace, Gerald Ryan. Defeat six, my golden eye, J40 and McRobert. One, Santelmo, Adrian Late, Anthony Cummings. Seven ran fourth, yours truthfully. And three ran fifth, Espresso Shot. Race time was one, 32.68. And the last 600 was clocked in 35.10. 35.10, the last 600. 1.32.68 is the overall time. The winner... Is a three-year-old by Star Witness out of an Alliant mare in Waddle. And Lester Grace does the riding for Gerald Ryan. Runners are returning to scale after race number two. Now margins are a long neck by half a length. It's a long neck by half a length the margins to race two.
<laughs> yeah. Just kicking up. Not too bad. 